Hello everyone, welcome to Write to Trick. Uh, as you know, on my channel, they, these are playlists on computer vision for PCA, 2D PCA, 2D square PCA. Uh, okay, these are for that. And I have also uh, my GitHub project where I have all the code, working code for face position using PCA, 2D PCA, 2D square PCA. So, in this video, I am going to uh, tell what are all these files and how can you use for recognize face for single person group image for video and for PCA 2D PCA 2D square PCA all these things so first of all you have to download this code okay and you are you need PyCharm because I am going to use PyCharm you can use whatever So this is, uh, let me extract this. Okay. <coughs> cancel, cancel, cancel. Open project. Downloads and this project the project will be opened after some time let it open completely first it's creating indices so let's see this uh, these are files cascades these are uh, our cascades which will be deleted by program to detect faces so and this is face detector you can use to this to uh, extract faces from images i will going to show you this in just a uh, minute and these will be image directory so you are going to create image directory where you are going to specify p1 person 1 and images of person 1 person 2 uh, like this so this is dataset dot py you don't uh, you have to only tell where your dataset is on which you are running your program so i am running going to run program on overall dataset so my dat uh, dataset is images directory and overall folder okay so wherever you keep your dataset just remember you have to separate each person in different folders okay keep faces um, of single person in separate folder so this is dataset file file close this this is face recognition file this is main file here uh, you don't need to change this file image to matrix and not neither this and I think almost all are called except these three so let's first uh, check this face recognition dot py so importing libraries importing classes so algo type this is one of main it tells which algorithm to use pc.py then use pca and for 2d pca then use 2d pca so whatever algorithm you tell here that file will be used from out of these three okay and what kind of recognition you want for single image use zero for video one for group two so i'm using single image then zero number of images for training left will be used as testing so let's see how many image single person has almost all has 10 images so i'm going to use um, 6 8 for training and 2 for testing so i think i don't need to change anything else so you have to only change algo type number of images if you have less and record type that's all run this program <coughs> hopefully i have installed all libraries otherwise there will be error there will be error because i do not have installed skype let's install i think i mentioned this in my requirements uh requirements numpy open cv and skype so make sure you already have this in file installed so pip install skype
collecting skype okay 25 mb let me post this video so i think skype is installed let me go to make my repository again so see steps otherwise there will be more error so single person group requirement numpy open vcv skype for single algo type choose out of these three record type uh, choose out of these three put data set in separate folders you can create data set by using extractor provider so we will talk about this later first of all let's run our program ok run again ok it's have their process is going on let it complete first uh, try running again and original image I can place after PCA okay these are trying to okay okay let's see results here so person 33 p9 correct p9 so i think one uh, let's try wrong first yeah mm, like this is wrong so it was correctly p6 and we said this is p17 so that's why this is wrong so this is results Correct total detected 73, wrong 3, total images were 76, percentage is 96. Let's see. Uh, okay, 93. I think at when I created this repository, uh, I was using some other parameters like different set of test images, like yeah, instead of 8, 6, or something. So this is giving percent 96 accuracy, total person, person was 38 training images for this that 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 so you now you can see how easy to run this program you just have to change this value algo type reco type and like this uh, let's try group image uh, i think i have some group image yeah images group group image and when reco type will be 2 then this code will be run uh, 0 one for this is for video and for this is two and for record type images group yeah i think this will work fine yeah uh, i am using same data set but i don't have group images of these guys <laughs> so this was icon face and after PCA, as you can see, after PCA, not much information is lost. Too many values to unpack. What were errors? Let's see what is going on here, man. Recognize face. Name, mean. Okay, let me see. I think let's try removing this mean I think this was some old code I forgot to change or something like that. Keep on man. Okay, okay. Yeah. I think uh detailing this is P sixty, this is P one seventy one, or I don't know why this is not directing. But as you can see, is it kind of working? I don't know what I did something wrong here. okay so my recognized face is only returning name but uh, I had some other parameter I think I'm going to remove that in repository also so this is face recognition file and working fine so now let's see face extractor and how to use so 
I think you don't need to change this file or you need to let's see this is a file which you are going to run from I think it needs full path face extractor dot yeah yeah it needed full path I think I need to make many changes on my repository okay and paste image face directory by folder so I think I have to set image for location so let's try on this folder set images folders location so I think uh, uh, let's first create folder this is group I'm going to create a new folder here persons so you have to create persons and you have to tell that this is person 1 whatever whoever has this so let's try if this was the case so let's try this running file yeah I hopefully it worked didn't it worked why temp mm -mm. directory persons if for name in directory I think I don't need to include p1 because it will going to check for all persons here persons even why not working set images folder looking to find image in, in all folders I think I have to remove this <laughs> backslash okay 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 I have to remove this into my face extractor, extractor folder maybe it will mark this time otherwise still not working yeah <laughs> something worked <laughs> file not found persons person okay it is trying on this folder not face extractor why why it is not trying mm. move this folder back to its home directory of project and now run yeah 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 what 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 persons 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 p1 yeah you can see that all the faces are extracted from the image and you can uh, create your own data set like ORL just make sure in image directory ORL all persons are separated in their own folders so for extracting face I'm going to repeat because I confused somewhat that create persons directory in your main project directory persons keep p1 like this p2 here and replace that here persons so I think that was clear so that's all those files and I told you how you can use them and hopefully it will help you in your project so if you like my video give thumbs up subscribe my channel and if you want to support my work you can buy me coffee that's all for this video thank you very much for watching thank you